Welcome to Interior Health's Adult Type 2 Diabetes video series. The topic of this video is the highs and lows of blood sugars. Just a few reminders as you watch this video series. We encourage you to watch the videos in order. And just remember, you can go back and watch the videos as often as you'd like. Fraser Health on the Road to Diabetes Health is a great resource to accompany this video series. And remember, you can pause the video at any time if you would like to spend a little bit more time reviewing the information. We would like to acknowledge that our work occurs on the beautiful, traditional, ancestral, and unceded territories of the First Nations of the Interior Region. We also recognize the Métis Nation and the contributions of the Métis peoples to the Indigenous ways of being and knowing on this land. In this video, we will be discussing hypoglycemia, which is low blood sugar, the treatment for hypoglycemia, what to do after hypoglycemia, and finally, hyperglycemia, which is high blood sugar. Hypoglycemia is when blood sugar drops below 4 millimoles per liter. People who take insulin or certain type 2 diabetes medications are at a higher risk of this side effect. Talk to your diabetes team if you are unsure if your medications could cause this. Symptoms of hypoglycemia can include shaky, sweaty, headachy, hungry, confused, dizzy, and grumpy. If you don't be, feel well, the best way to know if you have hypoglycemia is to check your blood sugar. The causes of hypoglycemia are not eating enough food, waiting too long to eat, a new increase in exercise or activity, too much insulin or too many diabetes pills, drinking alcohol without eating food, this can also cause hypoglycemia up to 24 hours after drinking. Try to always have a meal or snack if drinking alcohol. And finally, sickness such as vomiting or diarrhea can also cause hypoglycemia. It's important to treat hypoglycemia quickly. Always carry fast-acting sugar and wear diabetes identification, such as a medical alert bracelet. To treat, use the 15 and 15 rule. Take 15 grams of fast sugar, such as juice or glucose tabs, wait 15 minutes, then check your blood sugar again. If you are still below 4.0 millimoles per liter, repeat the 15 and 15 rule. Once your blood sugar is above 4 millimoles per liter, it is time to lock in the blood sugar with a meal or a snack. Hyperglycemia is when your blood sugar is too high. Symptoms can include hunger, extreme thirst, fatigue, weakness, frequent urination, and blurred vision. If you have symptoms, check your blood sugar. If it is above the targets outlined in the blood sugars and testing video, then check before every meal for the next couple of days to see if it's a pattern. You have just viewed the highs and lows of blood sugars. We encourage you to view the remaining videos for more information about living well with type 2 diabetes.